It's hard to watch how our food is made. <laughs> These pigs here, are you from here, Germany? Uh, no, I'm from the US. Oh, you're from the US? Oh, yeah. oh wow. So it's even worse. Well, yeah, it's pretty bad everywhere. Yeah. You've got these in the US though. I don't know if you've seen these before. Oh, uh, I've seen this one. What are they? What's this? The pigs? What are they in? A cage, like a small... Where one. does it go, this cage? It, these are the baby ones that get killed. They're not babies, these are six months old. These are this is the right age for people to eat. They get lowered into gas, this is a gas chamber. Yeah, they scream at the bottom and they try they try to escape and they rip their own arms off. It's uh, one of the most efficient, humane methods for killing pigs. They got a gas chamber two hours outside here of Berlin. They have them in Australia, the UK. I'm sure they have them in America as well. I used to eat these animals for many years, but now, no way. This is a free vegan challenge. You can do it on Facebook. Yeah, I uh, I was a vegan for like six months. Then, you were a vegan? Yeah, I was. And then it wasn't even the, the meat. It w wasn't eating animal hard products. So it was the, well, not eating meat was the easy part. Honestly, like milk products is what the hard dairy. part was. Yeah, dairy products was difficult. Cause, I mean, it's everything. Like, There's a lot of dairy and they sprinkle yeah. it throughout everywhere. It's also one of the cruelest products on earth. Yeah, it's, it's Do you know why it's cruel? Why? They separate the young from the mother mm, yeah. uh, because the, they, they will drink the milk otherwise. They kill the boys because boys don't produce milk, so sometimes they kill them on the first day of life, smash them on the head with a hammer, chuck them in the bin, or grow them for veal later on. The females, artificially inseminated, have you seen how they do that? No. I've they not. stick a fist inside of their anus to hold the cervix, they stick a tube full of bull semen inside of them when they're about a year old, then they, ha they have a baby after you know holding this baby in their stomach for nine months, they're separated from them and they mourn the loss of their child and this repeats for about five or six or seven years. They exploit them for their milk and then they go to a slaughterhouse to be butchered for their bodies. This is the dairy industry. Yeah, it's hard. It's, 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 yeah, it's horrible. Honestly, yep. I feel like the like chicken is even worse though. Chickens? Yeah, I mean, they're all bad. Like, look, look, it's a competition, which one's worse? Well, no, yeah, no. yeah, but, yeah no, but I, I agree. Chick like, even yeah. fish, if you want to go to the most exploited and abused animal on Earth, it's fish. Two to 2.7 trillion marine animals every year torn out the ocean, suffocated, stabbed, you know, murdered, essentially. Fish, that's huge numbers. It's only 74 billion land animals. So, yeah. So veganism isn't a diet, you know that, right? Yeah, yeah. It's a moral principle that extends out to diet. Yeah. So it's a moral principle against the abuse and exploitation of animals. Yeah. Simply. People have the idea that veganism is a diet, but it really isn't. No, yeah, like yeah. I, I don't I don't really use like animal products or anything like that. Yeah. Um, other than now. But you Still adhered to the yeah, moral uh, principle. No, yeah. I Wait, do. did you hold the moral principle as a yeah, belief? Yeah, that's what caused it, like caused me to yeah. stop eating. It was actually because of her. So you you go against your own morals now? I, I think most people do to some extent. There's a, like there are so many things that would be considered wrong on like a day-to-day -day basis. You can't adhere to every single one of them, or you would live a life that would be in pursuit of that and nothing else. But you can adhere to the moral principle of veganism because you did it for six months. Yeah. 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 So you know it's achievable, but inside now now you every time like you go for an animal product over a vegan product, you'd sort of be like, well, I would like I've been vegan now for five years. If I went against that, I'd be in my heart feel really torn like it would be because yeah. I hold it so dearly like like I hold dearly like I'm against the abuse of other human beings and, and children as well if I started abusing children or participating in the abuse of children I would be I would feel really like it would hurt my conscience a lot you know what I mean like yeah. it, and I feel like animals are on par with children in their innocence and vulnerability as well so six months old pigs you know what I mean yeah, no, that's sad. six week old chickens the slaughtered at six weeks old. Yeah, no chickens. That, that's, a, that's so crazy to me. The birds. Yeah. Now, well, you already know all this anyway, mate. I don't want to. I don't want to rip into you anymore. But it's okay. It's okay. We'll <laughs> Maybe you could try the vegan challenge again and Maybe. get back on the. the yeah, but it's a moral principle. You can't. You can't act. In, you can't adhere to morals and then, you know, go against them and go back onto them and you know. I know. I know. <laughs> you can, I study ethics. You study ethics? I did this for a long time. So. You study ethics, you know, animal ethics. Yeah. Oh, for one semester. 
Yeah. The moral part, you don't have to convince me. Yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> I mean, obviously, there's indirect harm we can't avoid, but there is definitely avoidable direct slavery and harm we can avoid. You know. We're just too weak. No, you're not. No, you're strong That's enough. The answer. That's no not even that. that but no, no. Too weak. That too weak for cheese and milk. Too weak for cheese. Too weak for the discipline. But there's so many vegan junk foods. Yeah, no, no. I'm not making. I'm not justifying it. I'm saying. I know it's wrong. I know that's a good. Right. That's a good position to have. You know it's wrong. Uh, but yeah, but you you do it anyway. I, yeah, I just recognize that I'm doing something that's wrong. That's do you feel like um? I don't know, do you feel like inconsistent in your, like when I, I knew for six months about this before I changed, I felt like I was living like this hypocrisy in my heart and then when I um, aligned my beliefs and actions I felt like I was in alignment and consistent and I had the, like that discomfort went away, the cognitive sort of dissonance of, you know, my actions contradicting my moral belief. No, no, I don't, I don't think you will. I mean, I'm, I know you are right. <laughs> so are you in your heart. But, you know, I mean, I guess it's how determined you are and how much of a desire you have to adhere to your own moral standard when it comes to the abuse of the innocent. I mean, so easy to avoid dairy and especially like in America. I don't know where, whereabouts in America you're from. We live in Denver. Denver. It's pretty easy. Yeah. It's There's easy, no excuse. Yeah. There's, There's no, no real excuse. For excuse. Anyone, really. No. Unless you're like extremely impoverished. No, even for them, like, animal products are a luxury. Huh? Animal products are a luxury. Oh, they're so much cheaper, though. No, there's so many beef, so many... Then, then rice and vegetable? Oh, oh yeah, that's they're a good very point. But, like, rice, lentils, beans, legumes, fruits yeah, yeah, are, like, the cheapest they're foods they're in the supermarkets. They're vegan. They're, they're vegetarian. Well, but a lot of them are. There's a few vegans in India, but most of them are vegetarian. They have mass dairy um, farms over there, like, big mega dairies. And they, sac they hold the cow so sacred, but all those cows get exported to be murdered for their body because so they're one of the biggest beef exporters and the biggest leather producers in India where they worship cows. Because of the, the dairy industry, they, they come from the dairy cows, which is crazy when you think about it. Well, thank you for being here. I... Yeah. We're trying to convince people to stop harming animals. <laughs> you can join us if you like. <laughs> These are all over the world, these AV chapters. Is there a way? This is anonymous for the voiceless. They're all over the world. I travel around the world, follow them around, and yeah, well, these happen everywhere. Yeah, I follow a few pages. I don't think I've heard of this one, but I follow a lot of people. Yeah, I, I know you're 100% right, so <laughs> convince people. I feel you. I feel you. I know you're. <laughs> You'll get back on it soon, I hope. You no, know, I will. I, yeah. I know it's on Today. Time, today's the day. What is this machine? It's a machine. What does it do, do you think? What, do you, what does this machine do? Do you know? Kill the pig. Yeah. How? With gas. This is a gas chamber. Gas chamber. Yeah. They scream at the bottom, they hit the gas, they try to escape. See? Yeah. Yeah.